On the night of Friday the 13th, a couple of friends find themselves in the forest of Blaine County on their annual hunting trip. However, things quickly turn extraordinary when they stumble across a mysterious man in the forest. The two friends find a gut-wrenching discovery which sends them rushing back to the nearby motel. Once back at the motel, an explosion rips through the parking lot, destroying all the working vehicles. Hundreds of miles away from the nearest town and no phone signal to speak of, the hunt begins. If you want to be in my next GTA video and join the Vada community, make sure to join my Discord, the link is in the description box down below. If you end up enjoying this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel, as we are really close to 700,000 subscribers. Where the hell is he? I thought I told him to meet me out here in five minutes. It's been an hour. Hello, Caden? Is everything alright? Man tried to charge me $100 for a flashlight. A hundred dollars for a bloody flashlight. I hope it fucking solves world hunger. Yeah, yeah. I, right. I Proper run a, a difficult business here. Look where we are. In what the middle the of nowhere. In you Bay. sold it to me for twenty dollars. What? Okay, okay, okay. Listen, I, I'm gonna let you come to some sort of an understanding over here, okay? If you need to juke it out outside or something like that, you know, Hunger Games battle to the death. I'm more than willing to watch that, okay? I need some good quality entertainment. Because the cable isn't working. I just left $5 on the table and walked out. You didn't even notice. Let's go. <laughs> Jesus, did you just steal? He was trying to, he's trying to scam me. Yeah, but that's no reason for you to steal. You left $5, right? That's not mm. good, bro. Underpaying. Oh, so. <laughs> Does anyone here want a uh, Coca Cola? Uh, I think I'm gonna be okay, buddy, but thank you. You, the other guy, who are you? You! I'm okay. Yeah, what's a... up? Yeah, let's just get in the car and let's head up to the I'm mountains, fine. huh? Uh, I'm good, bro. I need to give this Coca Cola to someone. Alright, hop in, brother. Two bucks. Yep. I'm good, I'm good. Please, sir. Yo, they've got some strange personalities at that motel. Fucking crackheads. Didn't really expect this, but honestly, we are in the middle of nowhere. I probably should have brought an SUV for this hunting trip. These roads did look better on my map, but granted, I did use an old World War II map for this. Yeah, you're gonna get this paint job dirty. It's alright, I'm sure I can pay someone at the hotel to clean this car in the morning. Alright, let me just actually pull up over here on the side, that looks like a nice little spot. Yeah, I think that will do. Alright. I'm just gonna grab the rifle from the back. All right. Ready to do this? You've got everything? Yeah, I got my binoculars, so I'll be your spotter. I'll try and spot people for you. People? Or not people. Well, yeah, I kind of hope so. I mean, the weather is not really in our favor today. It's a bit foggy out here. Yeah, I wonder if any animals come out of here. There's so much uh, life probably around these parts because there's a motel right there, so cars probably come by. Yeah, I mean, a lot of these animals probably are fairly domesticated, you know, they're not really scared of people, which, to be honest, could play into our favor. Yeah, they'll stand still right in front of us. Perfect shot. Exactly what I'm talking about. I mean, they're gonna be less likely to get spooked by something, which is great. Yeah, I reckon if we just keep following this road and somehow manage to get up to, uh, to the top of that hill, that might be a nice little vantage point for us to observe the valley. You know, camp it out for the night, see if uh, any animals are gonna come out. Should be a nice shot from up there. I do have to say that this area is looking mighty beautiful. Yeah, except for some of these dead trees. Surprised nobody's cut these down. The forestry service should be on this, because, I mean, it's a fire hazard. What the hell is up there? What? Do you see this? Looks like someone is standing on the ledge up there. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Yo, take your binoculars out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's walking off. What the hell? I mean, he might be camping out there. It looks like a nice camping spot with a nice view. Yeah. Um, he looks like he's looking down. Um. All right, yeah, we got to talk to the man. Listen, we got to tell him to stay near his camp because we don't want to, you know, shoot him accidentally. Mistaking him for some sort of an animal. He might be a park ranger. Um, uh, checking out the dead trees as we were talking about earlier. Maybe, but in the middle of the night? I don't know, dude. 
That guy was big. Did you see how big that guy was? Yeah, he was a chunky boy. Fucking lumberjack. Yeah, he reminded me of the mountain from Game of Thrones. Yeah, I reckon we find a path going up that hill, because like I said, we need to inform him to stay near the camp that we're going to be hunting in the area, because I don't want to have happy little accidents out here. Yeah, couldn't we just walk up right here? All right. I mean, it's not a bad shout. Yeah, let's give it a go. Just be careful, because, uh, you know, ground like this can be a bit misleading. Last thing we want is for you to twist your ankle, and then we have to carry your sorry ass down this hill. Yeah, if we can keep on heading further up, we're gonna have a nice vantage point into the valley. If we can find like a nice body of water, I'm sure some animals are gonna try to, you know, quench their thirst, so uh, it might be an easy shot. There's light uh, there, it could be candles. Maybe it is a grave site. That is creepy looking. It is creepy looking. Um. Yeah, just be careful. Stand away from the ledge. Last thing I yeah. want you is dropping down and <laughs> breaking your neck or something. <laughs> Maybe I'm hinting at something, but you know. <laughs> what the hell? Um, wait, is that blood? What the hell are you talking about blood? Is that not blood in the bush? I don't know, dude, but I don't like this. Oh, oh, oh. Um, Kaden, you're seeing what I'm seeing, right? Right, um, what are the odds that it's just a movie prop? <laughs> One in ten? Um... Right, okay, okay, yo, keep it down. There has to be a logical explanation as to why the fuck there is a severed head on the floor. Why the fuck would they have candles here? This looks like some sort of a ritual site. There's a fucking hand. This looks like some sort of spiritual shit. Is that paper? Yeah, it's a bunch of notes. Um... I can't really make out what it says. It, it, it looks like a bunch of gibberish. I'm not touching it to get a closer look. Yeah, no, 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 don't, don't, don't. Just in case this is a real fucking head, dude. Like, last thing we want is our fingerprints all over this thing. It also smells. Do you see these footprints everywhere? Yeah, I do. They are huge. That's like size 15. Holy shit. What the hell? And they just randomly disappear in this bush. You, you think that guy just killed somebody and that's why he, he saw us and he walked away? I mean, I don't know. That body seems to have been dead for at least two days. Listen, I'm no forensics expert, but when it's purple like that, it's been dead for a while. Jesus. Yeah, I think it's best that we get down to the hotel and call the cops, dude. Uh, yeah. yeah, just try not to touch anything because like I said, we don't want to leave any fingerprints on here. Maybe there's some sort of a logical explanation. Maybe it's some kids playing a prank. Maybe this is part of some sort of a movie set or something. But, uh, yeah, I'm a bit worried. Yeah, that looks like a thigh. So, uh, yeah, right below the head. Yeah, mm. I don't think the smell is something that they can fake like that. Yeah, we can get down here, but just be super careful because it is very steep. Oh, 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 you bastard. Ah, it's okay. It's just a flesh wound. Do you have your map out with you? No, I forgot. Shit, to it God the damn it. How the hell did you not bring anything out with you? You knew we were going hunting a week in advance. I have binoculars, all right? I got prepared. I can't afford a map. What do you mean you can't afford a map? They're like $2. I'm not rich like you, okay? I don't have... Okay, we're talking shoes. about two bucks over here. You probably spent yeah. like, you know, $30 a week on beer. Yeah, that definitely put me off hunting. Is he, he's back at the shrine. What? You not see him? Oh, um, he, it's either my eyes are playing tricks on me or he just disappeared. Bro, I don't see anything. There's nothing up there. Okay, I think my eyes are playing tricks on me. No, there's nothing up there, dude. I don't, I don't see anything. I just see the light coming from the candles. Let's go. Let, let's go. I, I don't like it. Let's. All right, get in the car. Put the gun in the back seat. No need to put it in the trunk. Dude, the, the crackles from my exhaust absolutely scared the living bejesus out of me. So let's just recoup what we just saw, right? So we saw a decapitated head, a mysterious figure in the middle of the forest, in the middle of the night. It, that makes no sense to me, though. It doesn't either to me. Let's just get the hell out of here. We've got to tell the hotel owner. 
Yeah, but he has to know about this. Nah, dude, his his dad wasn't it his uh, dad's place. He's not gonna know anything. He's young. Yeah, but we gotta tell him. They've, they've gotta have some sort of a phone, you know, to call the police. To come out here and investigate what we just saw. Last yeah. thing we want is get this thing pinned on us. Uh, can I talk to you for a second? Sure. Um, is there anything weird uh, going on in this forest at all? Have you heard like any rumors or anything? Um, let me see. Any rumors? Well, there's a pack of like wild people, like in a hut around those mountains, I guess. But besides that, not really. Right. Okay. So, uh, what I what, what I'll tell you, uh, might not make much sense to you. Uh, so basically, you know how we were out there hunting for deer. Um, we came across some sort of a uh, a person just perched up on top of a hill. You know, our reasoning was we're just gonna approach him, tell him to stay near his camp if he's camping out there, and you know, just make sure he doesn't get in the way of our bullets, just in case we. You know, uh, we want to shoot some deer, but when we got there, we saw a decapitated head and some sort of a, uh, a shrine next to a dead tree. Uh, it's hard to explain. A bunch of notes were scattered on the ground. It was just a bunch of gibberish that I couldn't really understand. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know how to, what, what else to say. What are you talking about? Are you sure you didn't like, inhale those fumes from that lumber mill or something? No, pretty confident. My 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 friend here, Caden, saw it too. Um, why why are you calling me for this? Call the damn cops. Yeah, we tried, but we've got no reception on our phones. Like the nearest town is a hundred miles away. I thought maybe you can have like some sort of a uh, stationary phone or something. I mean, you have a landline. I could try that. I mean, give it a go and yeah. How far is it up the mountain? Is it like really far or is it just like close? Well, if you basically just head kind of like west from the lumber mill, maybe like, uh, I don't know, 200 meters up the hill, uh, it's hard to say. Great. So you said you've seen somebody up there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a, a towering figure. Like that guy legit looked like something out of Game of Thrones. Like we found a bunch of footprints on the scene as well. They were at least size 15. The man was huge. Did you see what he looks like? Besides him being extremely tall? Uh, no, we didn't really catch a good glimpse at the guy. Like, when we kind of tried to approach a bit closer, he just, you know, disappeared. Uh, he just, just walked off. When we got up the mountain, which took us quite some time, we we couldn't really find anything. Far over there, you get yourself a drink and calm down. Yo, Robin, I'm gonna head to bed, alright? Maybe that's not a good idea. Can we get everybody over here? I think it's important that everybody knows. All right, hold on. You guys stay here. I'm gonna go yeah, if you guys don't mind, just gather around for a second. Uh, I guess we've got an announcement to make. All right, listen up. Can I have you guys' attention, please? Yeah, um, so as some of you might know, we went out hunting uh, up to the hills. But we came across something we didn't really expect. We, we came across some sort of a, uh, a giant figure. A giant man, you can say. Uh, but when we approached him, we didn't really find anything apart from a uh, decapitated head just on the forest floor. Uh, and what appeared to be some sort of a, a shrine up the mountain. So I think it's going to be a best idea that we all stay put for the night. We don't adventure into the forest. Okay? And we try to get the cops on this uh, first thing in the morning. Are you not smoking anything or drinking anything? Uh, no, dude, I'm pretty I'm confident. Listen, I made something. sure we stayed sober this entire time, okay? Nah, I don't uh, believe you. I, I kind of don't believe you. I'm sorry. Oh, man, speak for yourself. Bro. Oh, for fuck's sake. Like seven drinks tonight already. Yeah, well, it's habit. I can't help it. I sold coffee for 50 cents if you need it. Okay, now is not the time to make a sales pitch, brother. Jesus. I mean, like, we literally just saw a decapitated head out there, like, and you're talking about coffee. Could yeah, it be a movie prop? Here. That's what we're thinking, but the smell, I, I don't think you could fake that. It might be one of those cartels that are around here. Cartels? Yeah. 
Nah, there, there is like a little like uh like yeah, there's cabin, this one group of them. camp looking areas. Yeah. Bunch of the naked cannibal people. I thought they were all Roomba. What the hell are you guys nah, talking it's about? Real, bro. Go ahead back into my then. Why does no one uh, believe me? I'm not kidding. I'm gonna need one, I'm gonna need one of those. Oh, this is probably a dangerous animal. I think, I'm in a close hey, I think you should quit the drinking, my guy. What the fuck? Holy shit, Yo, those. That's my fucking car! Wait, no, what wait, the hell? Fuck. Eh, what? That's the guy! That's the guy! That's the guy! Wait, Yo, take a bit. What the hell? Holy shit! I literally got in last month. I'm not paying for any of this. I'm not paying for those. Okay, you guys saw the figure, right? You guys saw the man. That's what I'm talking about. That's what we saw up the mountain. Yo, take pictures, okay? Because my insurance company is not going to believe what just happened. Shoot. But did you see? That thing that we saw up the mountain was just standing in the flames, unharmed by it. He's got pictures. Come on. Wait, what oh, I got pictures of it. Is there is, is there like a way we can get the fuck out of here? I don't think it's safe for us to stay here. Actually, hold on. You My know, that's old truck. Actually, hold on. Follow. Where is it? Old truck. Oh, it's this man. There's supposed to be the fake man. Have another beer. Oh Jesus. Yeah, we what got. Problem, though? We well, what's problem the problem? Bro, that looks like a piece of junk. You really expect it's this thing to run? Car. Can you pop the hood, my guy? Pop the hood real quick. Um, it'll turn on, but like... What the hell do we need to start fixing up this thing? Just pop the hood, at least. We need to find parts immediately. So, I would recommend you have a kite. Wait. No. Oh, no. Close the hood. Close the hood. We don't want any ah, water getting in it. Ah, just what we needed. A thunderstorm. Put it under the cover. Put it under the cover. I, well, well, I can't drive it. Idiot. That's the problem. We need parts for this car. At least a muffler. We need a new gas pipe. And, He's gonna and He's gonna a kill all of us. engine valves. He's gonna kill all of us. He's gonna do it. So we need a muffler. We need a gas pipe. And we need like a few engine valves for this thing to work. All right. Let's get to work then. Let's not waste any time. Flashlights here. Grab one. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Keep you up. Got the the shop. Free free out. Yeah, the one you charged me a hundred. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That that charged charged me seventy-five dollars. Do you know kind of the lay of the land? Do you know like what, what we can find around these parts? Um, I'm not entirely sure, but it could be down the road or something. Yeah, because I saw uh, on my old map there is an old World War II bunker just to the north. We can check that out first. Right. Yeah, I agree with that. Umbrella man, uh, photographer, and Caden, we're gonna go together. The rest of you, oh, God damn it. stick together, all right? Let's go. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, on the old maps, it's just up ahead. God, why did it have to rain on a day like this? I know, it was beautiful weather. You guys see that? Up there. Oh, wow. This oh. Is yeah, cool. I think that's the bunker I was talking about. What is up? Oh my god, yo, it's slippy. Oh, this thing is okay? covered in moss. Alright, start searching, guys. Hey, hey, here, here's some of the engine valves. Yeah, grab them then. Sure. Right, should we just drop it at the motel or what do we do? Say we drop it off by the motel because, I mean, you know, the more people that can hold stuff, I mean, you don't know how big an object's gonna get. Why are yeah, they exactly. Us? Who? Good question. Uh, three people. Where do you see them? Alright. Alright. Right. Right. Hey, hey, oh happened? yeah, you guys all right? No, that damn thing again. That we saw him. Guy in the mask. Why do you have your shotgun out? What the what fuck? He had a machete. It was bloody. It was in the parking lot. Oh, what? Fuck. Wait, the thing that we Wait, saw was in the parking lot again. Burned up, didn't it? All right, listen, let's stick to our teams, okay? And let's search this forest. Jesus, behind us. What? Stop moving. Oh, oh there he is! Oh, what the heck? Stop moving. Uh, Shoot guys, him. he's got a fucking machete on him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Uh, okay, so this makes absolutely no sense. Run, 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 run into run. the forest. Did you see how big that guy was? Yeah, I know. And he took two pellets to the head. Oh my god, Fuck this. that guy is oh, not so real. I mean, he looks real to me, but I just don't understand. Is he wearing some sort of body armor on his face? No. I mean, 
he's wearing a mask. Maybe it's made out of Kevlar or something. Oh, God. Listen, it's gonna be okay. I'm sure there's a logical explanation for all of this. Let's just focus, get those car parts, and get the fuck out of here. Hey, there's a shed up there. Y'all see that? Where? A shed. Oh, yeah, I see, I see it. All right, after you, boys. Uh, there looks to be a gas canister. Anything? Uh, it doesn't look uh, like it. No. no, I don't think that's gonna be anything useful. We can check out that silo up ahead. Wait, there's a box over here. Hold up. Uh, let me have a look. This might be useful. A catalytic converter. Huh. Yeah, I, I think that's also what we need. Please. Yeah, I'm gonna take that just in case. It might be useful. All right, let's go into the factory. Come on, guys. Uh, I hear shots. Right, let's just look for any machinery. I'm sure we can, you know, reverse engineer it to make it work in a car. Is there anything at all? I don't expect we're gonna find people in here. In the middle of the night, but at least the lights are on. Yep. Hold up, let's see inside. Oh shit, yo, careful, this is a conveyor belt. I think we hit a matter load, boys. Definitely need a spark plug, okay. There's a new, yeah. uh, right. new gearbox, we, we might be plug. able to change that as well. Oh, radiator. Uh, guys, 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 guys. Where? Move, move! Get the fuck out of here! Shoot, what the hell? Shoot. Just run, 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 run! Get to the train tracks! Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck is he? Oh! No, I am not dying today. I am not dying today. I am not dying today. I am too young. I've got too much to lose. I've got too much to lose. Just manifest it. Fake it till you make it, okay? Fake it till you make it. Oh shit! Run! You gotta move, move, move! He's down the train tracks! Down the train tracks! Jesus! Just go, 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 go! Just don't stop! Don't look at him, okay? Don't tell me he killed the other people down at the hotel. I don't know, I heard shots though. That doesn't bode good for the other guys. Alright, we've got a few more parts. Just a few more parts and we'll be able to fix that car up. Just keep running, okay? And don't stop. Don't look back. We're gonna be fine. Remember, we've got a lot to live for, okay? Fake it till you make it. We're way too important, okay? We've got plot armor. I hope this is some sort of a prank and all of a sudden someone's gonna come out of the bushes and tell us where all the cameras are. Well, that's a repair workshop. Oh, yes. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. Yeah, check it out. What do you see? Uh, muffler and exhaust pipe. Uh, what else are we missing? I don't know. Just anything we can get our hands on to get that junk up and running. Uh, guys, there there are enough parts left to we already got everything. Yeah. So you guys on? have you everything, guys yeah? Um, yeah. I, I, I mean, I think my group one. All right, good. Let's just head back to the hotel. We found some bits by the sawmill as well. We might be able to get this car up and running. You guys all right? He's here. He's here. Oh, Where? Shit. Holy oh. shit! Move back! Move back! Move back! No, how much ammunition do you have? Oh shit! He's right here! Oh, right here! Move, 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 move! Get the fuck out of here! Quickly, pass me all the parts that you've got. I'm gonna try to fix up the car. Just let me know if he's coming, okay? Where have you been? Where have you been? Have you been to the... Shit, we need a new piston! This one is all rusted up! Run! Oh! Oh, fuck! Oh. oh my god! Move! Move! I don't want to die, bro. I don't we need the piston. We need the piston, okay? And we're gonna be fine. Do you know where we can find a piston? That's the last part where, that we need. Uh, maybe uh, there's a wood factory. I'll, I'll, We've already checked out the wood factory. We we took I everything of value there. I found a note next to my my house that might give us to a car that we can scrap or something. Whereabouts is it? It's a note. It says like some guy's car broke down on the side of the road or something. All right, let's check it out. Come on. Oh god, I should have worked on my cardio. Yeah, you're not the fastest, are you? He's behind us. He's behind us. Keep running. Shit. Listen, I'm gonna fucking hide. I ain't dying today. Oh, shit. 
Why is it just standing there? Uh, what the hell is going on? It looks like he's just playing with us, like it, we are his prey or something. Like this is all a game to him. man picked up the piston. I'm going back. Screw this shit. Yeah, let's see if we can start refueling the car already, okay? So when the guy gets back with the piston... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything is basically working apart from the piston. So we can refuel the car and hopefully by the time he's back we can get that thing up and running in no time. Oh, shoot! Oh, shit! What the fuck? No, 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 no! How the hell did he get here? I swear to God, I swear to God, I swear to God, I saw that man behind me and now he's in front of me. Oh no. No way, no way, no way. Shit. Where the hell is he? Oh no, I don't like this. Where the hell is everybody? Oh no. That's the store owner. I think he had it coming with all the overpriced- <gasps> Shit. Are you kidding me? It's a game to him. Yeah, I don't think there's anything you can do for him. I saw that knife go straight through his gut. Guys, 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 move, move! Where the hell is he? Oh shit, there he is, there he is, there he is, there he is! has got personal grudge against me what did i do where the hell is the guy with the piston hey hey shit oh, oh no <laughs> just, just try and get out all right grab the piston grab the piston guys and let's go 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 let's get going let's get going let's go 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 right, guys she's here come on oh, you gotta drive 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 no please Drive! No! I'm sorry, Kaden! I'm sorry! You gotta break the car in a second! Come on! Yeah, let's see. Don't go through in here! What the hell are you doing? What the hell are you doing, man? No, he's here, he's here. Oh wait, 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 we've got survivor! Get him in, get him in! Hop in, hop in! Go, go, go! Just go, go! All right, let's get the hell out of here. What's wrong? I don't Do think there's anybody the else left alive. Final. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. I'm not going back there. Uh, yeah, sorry I think about I'm the hotel. Gonna, I think I'm gonna pass out real quick. I don't think that I'm going. I don't think I'm gonna go to any hotel anymore this year. Let's just hope we've got enough fuel to get to the nearest town. 